What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I am out front of my house right now. <laughs> Funny story. Um, so first of all, I just got back from New Orleans. I was in New Orleans for like four days and I just got back. I'm headed to Charleston for the Food and Wine Festival on Tuesday or no Wednesday of next week. There's been a lot of big days of eating and on days like these, I like to think about some higher protein, lower fat things that I could do a video with, um, especially so I can like try to create content for you guys, obviously. And I was really craving sushi, but car videos I feel like are really best with like handhelds, things that you guys can like see all of while I'm eating it, or most of it anyways. So it's like blizzarding outside right now. There's like very, very snowy. Um, and to boot, my friend like kind of scared me because there's apparently been like a lot of carjacking. So I decided to have it delivered, but I'm like, I still want to eat it in my car. So I'm literally just at my place waiting for the delivery guy to get here. I got some sushi burritos, which I'm really excited about. I have not tried this place before. It's called Soda Roll, S-O-T-A-R-O-L. So like Minnesota Soda Roll. They're known for their sushi burritos. So I got a spicy tuna sushi burrito and then a shrimp tempura with crab. I added mango to the spicy tuna and I added extra spicy tuna and extra crab to their respective rolls because I was worried that there wasn't gonna be enough protein. Some of the photos of this place have looked like they like kind of skimp on that. So we'll see, we'll see. That's honestly why I haven't done a video with them yet is because I thought that it was just gonna be like all rice. So. Fingers crossed, maybe I didn't need to get extra protein, um, but the Dasher, DoorDash, this is not an ad by the way, my Dasher will be here momentarily, hopefully, because guys, it is like getting dark out soon. <laughs> Words you've never heard come out of my mouth before. All right, they literally just got here. I feel super creepy <laughs> watching them drop it off at my door and leave. Also, I feel like I can see my breath in my car. I've got the car on because the heat has to be on. Oh my God, I didn't have the heat on. My seat warmer was definitely on. My hands are so cold, I obviously can't put gloves on heat though. All right, I'm gonna go get the food and I'll be right back. Good Lord. I swear I could see my breath in here. My nose is like... <laughs> when it's this cold, the inside of my nose will start to freeze. Like any moisture in there will just freeze and it just like crunches on the inside of my nose. I'm sure you guys remember this little guy, which thank you for the recommendation. I got it on Amazon. Didn't know they existed. I guess I should have taking my coat off before I put that on. Yes. All right, please be good. Please be good, please be good. I am so hungry. What else is new? I feel like I've got like hair all over me. My hair has gotten so long. I don't know if you guys noticed or not. Quite a feat for me. It takes my hair forever to grow. Forever. It smells good. It smells good. Good sign. All right, I'm gonna show them to you. Per huge. So this is also a piece of tin foil. Good start, good start. <laughs> So this is the shrimp tempura and crab with extra crab. I got some spicy mayo and some, it said citrus soy, so I'm assuming that means ponzu sauce, which I love. I don't know if it'll be good on a sushi burrito, but here we are. And I'm gonna show you the second one. Gosh, they both look really good. I'm glad I got the double meat though, or the extra meat. I don't know if it's technically double or not. That looks pretty dang good. All right, guys, 
very, 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 very excited about all of this. They gave me soy sauce and wasabi and stuff, but I just can't see myself going into that in the car, especially. And I feel like a sushi burrito is meant to be like, I don't know, an on the go thing. And for soy sauce and wasabi, I like, I need chopsticks to mix that up. You know, it's just not something I'm willing to do. Pre-mixed sauces, yes. The other stuff, no, no, I don't think so. All right, actually, I think I do want to try this crab one first. This does have spicy mayo on it already. So I'm gonna try it without dipping it in, 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 in without dipping it into anything. And then we can see about the dippage situation afterwards. It's really pretty, by the way. It said it recommended a soy wrapper, which I probably wouldn't have normally chose, but it's really pretty. I have nothing against soy wrappers. I'm just like not against seaweed, I guess. So full that it can barely stay closed. Man, I must need bigger wrappers. There is snow all over my car. All right, let's do this. It's good. I feel like I could do without the cream cheese. I didn't realize it had cream cheese. And I'm not like a cream cheese in my sushi person. Though I do love cream cheese, so I'm not sure why that is. It tastes really fresh so far though. This is the number one seller. I was gonna say on their site, but just like their number one seller. I want to say, oh, that's jalapeno. I was expecting this to be a little bit spicier. Let's try some spicy mayo. Their spicy mayo is really good. A good amount of soy sauce in there. And actually spicy. Some spicy mayo is just like has like the tiniest kick. I'm like, what the heck? And I don't even, well, it's not that I don't like spice, but I can't even handle spice all that much compared to most people. Everyone tries ponzu. I would show you, but it seems a little dangerous. taking out some of the cream cheese. I don't know what my problem is. I feel like it makes it really heavy. That's what I think. Most of the time I'm eating sushi because I want something like lighter. So I'll typically go for rolls that have a lot of fresh fish. This ponzu is kind of smoky by the way. I love sushi rice. It's like slightly sweet. Kind of tangy. They offer brown rice too, but you know. Really good. Minus the cream cheese. Definitely good without the cream cheese next time. All right, so remember, I added mango to this one. Is it really? Mm-hmm. And that little guy. 
I'm very excited. Some places, again, like their spicy mayo, like spicy tuna is an all those spicy, which I guess wouldn't surprise me in Minnesota because everything's very like Minnesota nice as far as spice level is concerned. I feel like another reason I stray away from soy paper is because it's so delicate. I feel like it falls apart really easily and kind of came apart here. It's been fine overall though. You guys want to see the dippage? Mm. Lots of sesame oil. Sesame chili oil, sorry. Very spicy. Very sesame oily. Which I love. Not oily. Not to be mistaken. <laughs> I am a huge fan of sesame oil. Maybe even too much? Obviously a preference thing. But it's there. I'm actually really glad that I got the spicy mayo because it has a very different flavor from the spicy tuna. It also goes with all the flavors in the spicy tuna. No! The mango is key. And this really needs something else to break up that flavor. I mean, I know I got extra spicy tuna, so maybe it would have been more balanced with less. But it was only supposed to be like cucumber, mm, spicy mayo, and spicy tuna. Maybe something else inside? Mango is so good with tuna. So good. One of my fave combinations with sushi. That was pretty good. Better than I thought. Happy about the extra protein. I feel like maybe I want a few more bites. It was really spicy. A lot of sesame oil. A lot. So if you really love it, I think that you would like that. But I don't know, for me, it's too overpowering. That sesame oil. really rich.
I haven't done a car video in forever. I've got so many napkins in here. All right. Whoa. Yeah, again, really happy I got to try this place out. I'm feeling pretty good right now, so I'm going to stop. But things I liked. I actually really do like the soy wrapper just because of the color and because it's not like super thick, but neither is seaweed. Seaweed holds up better, in my opinion. Yeah, again, cream cheese, but that's just me. If you like cream cheese, I'm sure you would love this. Everybody loves this. I mean, as far as all the people that have ordered it, on DoorDash, 100% of the people liked it. They gave it the thumbs up, at least the people that voted for it. So that's the fave. I can see why. Happy I got the extra protein. And then the spicy tuna was the third most popular thing on their menu after there was like a gyoza or a, a, some kind of dumpling. And I suppose I can see why Again, I love sesame oil, but there is too much of a good thing. And I just feel like, yeah, there's too much sesame oil in there. And there's not much you can do to change that. <laughs> it's just the mix uh, in the spicy tuna. So probably wouldn't order that one again, but would be interested to order maybe like a salmon one. Salmon is by far my favorite raw fish. So we would totally try salmon next time. I just, I think the size of these are really good too. They're not too big. I think with the added protein, it's got the right amount of filling, not too much rice. Pleasantly surprised, soda roll. Pleasantly surprised. <laughs> I don't want to seem like I had like really low expectations, but I'll just say that they weren't like ridiculously high. Is that fair? Is that fair? I'm sorry. It's just based on the pictures, which looked like they were all rice. Car videos make me like so crazy. Usually <laughs> I can't believe how calm I am today and maybe TMI, but just started my period. Like I was really hungry. This is a pat on the back of my You guys have no idea. I have like fully lost my mind with car video things for a variety of reasons. There's just like so many things that have happened to me during them. That and support calls, I swear, have just taken so much time off of my life. Maybe it's because I have someone editing my videos for me now. Her name is also Lindsay and she's also a mukbanger. So I'll put her information right here. I'm so happy that I have somebody editing for me now. Guys, it frees up so much of my time that I can now spend on filming more, conceptualizing more, being more creative, spending more time with my family, which right now just really means my cats and my husband, but mostly my cats. Anyways, just real proud of myself. Hopefully I can continue this like super chill car video train in the future. Or whatever all right guys well thank you so much for joining today this was really fun um really happy i got to try something new and that it was sushi i am so excited because i'm filming something else tomorrow actually i'm not even sure what one of two things both of them are on the docket for like videos i'm filming very soon i've only got three videos that i've got like fully planned coming up with three concepts and i mean i think you're gonna love all of them but two of them in particular one of them in particular y'all are just going to be like, oh my god, that is so delicious. So very excited to be filming one of those tomorrow. It is pasta. Just FYI. Thank you guys so much for joining today. I just can't tell you how much I appreciate you coming here, spending time, supporting me. Without you guys, I would have no career. I would not be able to do this. It's the best job ever. So you guys are freaking awesome. I love Comment below what you guys thought of Soda Roll and these sushi burritos. I'm sure you guys have had a sushi burrito at this point. It's like, I don't know. When did they get invented? Like 10 years ago? Something like that. I feel like everyone's had a sushi burrito, so you eat sushi. But yeah, let me know what you thought about these. How did they look to you? Would you go and eat their Soda Roll? Let me know in the comments. And yeah, as promised, it is like really getting dark out there but with the snow it's amazing like i'm just surrounded by white and the white reflects light <laughs> didn't mean to rhyme there but so it's actually surprisingly bright in the car considering the street lights are now on <laughs> i'm nothing if not consistent 
All right. Thank you guys so much again for joining today. And I will see you guys. Chef's kiss to all of you. Mm -hmm. oh.